What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be showing guys how to move your Steam games from one hard drive to another. So, if you're like me, you may have multiple hard drives in a computer. Personally, I have one SSD which has my Windows on it and some games, and I have another one terabyte hard drive. Now, this doesn't have to be from an SSD to an HD to a hard drive. It can be from a hard drive to another hard drive or an SSD to another SSD. It, it doesn't really matter. Personally, I'm going to be moving some of my games from my SSD to my hard drive because my SSD is just running out of space. If you guys can see, um, if I go to this PC, local disk C is my SSD and local disk D is my hard drive. As you can see, I only have about 60 gigs left on my SSD and like 800 gigabytes left on my hard drive. So I'm, I'm going to move some games from here to here because I, I need to make space for like other stuff on my SSD. By the way, you don't need to uninstall and reinstall something that could take literally hours and I just don't have time for that. And you guys probably don't have time for that either. So let's get straight into it. The first thing you want to do is make a new Steam library folder on the new location, which is which in my case is my hard drive. You can do that through Steam. All I have to do is go to Steam settings and right here where it says content libraries, the first one, um, click on Steam library folders, go to add library folder and then browse to the new hard drive. Make sure you go, you actually go to a new hard drive. Make sure you choose a new hard drive. You have to press this tab right here. So go to D and then make a new folder and then yeah leave it at steam library but as you can see i already have a steam library folder in my d drive just because i already have games installed on there uh, as you can see i have 800 gigabytes left of free space so that shows that that this is my hard drive so once you've added the folder uh name it steam library um go to the go to that same folder that you just created uh local disk d steam library now you have to make subfolders inside it if, if, if subfolders called steam maps and common are not already made just make them yourself just go to new folder and call it steam maps okay and within steam maps right click new folder call it common because that's common because uh, steam library steam maps common are all where all your game files are as you can see here so what you want to do is copy the game files from your old location, which is on my SSD. So usually if it's on your OS, it's in program files 86, Steam, and again, Steam apps common. But if it's on another hard drive, you go to where your old game is. So here it is, uh, Counter-Strike. I'm going to move Counter-Strike to my uh, hard drive. Just copy it and paste it to the new location which is of course in my hard drive d steam library if i can find it here it is steam apps comment and just right click and press paste now this will take a little bit of time so just wait for that and i'll be right back all right so it is finished and by the way that time will uh, vary depending on how big the game is and how fast your hard drives are if you're moving game like gta 5 which is about 70 gigabytes in in size of course that part in particular will take a pretty long time so basically once you've copied the new game files into your new location you don't you don't want to delete this by yourself you want to let steam do it so all you have to do is go to the game which is counter-strike right click and delete local content now this will delete the game files in the c location in your old hard drive it won't delete the one that you that you just copied delete local content delete and once it's uninstalled you can check that it's uninstalled if you go to c and program files 86 steam steam apps comment as you can see uh go there's nothing really in here yeah you can delete this folder basically yeah so now once you've done that all you have to do is right click and install the game now this is important make sure you install under your new location as you can see, don't install under C because that's where your old one was. Go to install under D Steam Library. This will not take hours or the usual time it was. As you can see, the estimated download time is three hours. Of course, this will only take a few minutes because the game is already installed and all it has to do is like make some minor tweaks. So if you hit next, it's preparing the the files. But as you can see, a little bit, it will say it's gonna it's detecting yeah it's discovering existing files since the whole game is already installed on the new drive. This will only take about a couple of minutes. So I'll be right back and I'll and I'll come back and I'll tell you how long it took for me. All right, as you guys can see, it is completely done installing and downloading Counter Strike to the new hard drive. That only took about um, like less than two minutes. Uh, it said 6:47 p.m. before, and now it's only 6:48. So that was super quick. Of course, not going to take hours. As you can see, it, it it was put on my desktop here. There's some updates has to do. That's zero percent. 
it's already re al almost ready to launch so it's done updating that took only about again two minutes so that is how to move one steam game from one hard drive to another hard drive it's really quick it doesn't take hours you don't have to uninstall and reinstall it hope you guys enjoy this video if you guys want to do another video on how to move origin games because those because that's a little different um then just leave it in the comments below but uh, thank you guys so much for watching hope this helped you guys and if it, do you think it'll help other people please share it with your friends who are falling into this problem. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out, guys.